Hi, Peter here. I'm a hypnotist, NLP practitioner, certified supervisor in grief recovery, as well as an addiction therapist and codependent therapist. And I've been working in the communities in Stockholm, Sweden for many years. Today, I'm going to give you a hypnotic experience. Uh, reading from the book, Unpack Your Existence, and the chapter, Create the Creator. So in a few moments, I will uh, ask you to take a deep breath. So let's start. You take that deep breath now and hold it for a while. And breathe out. Close your eyes. Feel the relaxation spreading from your head down to your toes. That's right. For every breath you take, the re relaxation will get deeper and deeper. Twice as deep, ten times as deep. That's right. And you can notice noticing things. You can notice my voice. You can notice your own breath. You can notice the sounds around you. That's right. Because we can relax physically and mentally. And there's no limit at all how much we can relax mentally. So we can go even deeper and deeper. That's right. And I, I will continue speaking. You are the creator. All people are similar and everyone is different. You are a dynamic flow of amazing and continuous adaption to life. Now is the time to do this on purpose. Enjoy the ride. It's all in your head. You just have no idea how big your head is. The adventure of life includes exploring and unleashing the potential of the specific time and circumstances you live in. Your most powerful companion is your imagination. It is the source of every human action, piece of art, improvement and discovery. It can motivate you to boldly go where no man has gone before, and it can allow you to spend a wonderful night at home with a smile. It is the voice in your head that creates the images notions that guide you. Choose words that paint a map you wish to explore. The very nature of your imagination is to be limitless in ways the physical world isn't. On the one hand, you have an amazing potential stored in the wizardry of your genes, a self-generating body an environment with oxygen to breathe and gravitation to keep you from drifting into space. On the other hand, you have an imagination that can invent ways to breathe underwater and fly you to the moon. Among the most wonderful and potentially dangerous abilities of human imagination is the ability to unite and collaborate around an idea. To facilitate communication over thousands of years, we have invented writing. And to spread it instantly around the world, we have built the mighty internet. It isn't norms and laws that rule society. It is how we imagine them ruling us. You are as free 
as you imagine yourself to be. We are as united as we think we are. Let's make sure we pick the right ideas to collaborate around. Stress is created by your imagination, but so is calm. Standing between you and your potential are your ideas of what is possible. Allow these ideas to evolve, and so will your plans and actions. You can use your imagination to transform your experiences, memories, beliefs, and emotional responses into strategies and knowledge, into the kind of wisdom that allow you to truly explore the full experience of life. Imagination offers you an ocean of possi possibilities. Get wet. In a few moments, I will start counting from one to five. And when I reach the number five, you will be back to normal consciousness. You will be fully awake, feeling good in every way. One. A little more awake already. Two. Feel the energies coming back to your body. Three, half wake. Four, almost awake now, but not until the last number. Five, got back to normal consciousness, fully awake, feeling good in every way, and you can open your eyes. Okay, that was it. I would really appreciate if you give this a uh, thumbs up. And hit that subscribe button now. That's right. Thank you. See you.